Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Gina DeVecchio. Well, we're tracking some rainfall off the coast, and we are going to be seeing that uh, moving into our region by later today and into tomorrow. Uh, but taking a look outside right now, you can see we still have some areas of some uh, stars out there, but getting lighter in Big Sur. You can also see those clouds that will be increasing throughout today. Temperatures decreasing a little uh, cooler than where we were yesterday. Some low 40s in some of our inland valleys like Hollister to Gilroy. And then you can see 50s near the coast and in some of our mountains. Upper 40s for Soledad down to King City. Now for today, temperatures are going to be noticeably cooler, right around 60 degrees for many, maybe a little warmer in some mid 60s uh, before the rain moves in. Now there's a little 20% chance of showers the first part of the day. Those are very spotty, very hit or miss. Uh, not likely that you are going to see that earlier in the day, but later after about sunset, the sun goes down right around six o'clock and I think we're going to be seeing those rain chances increasing in that time frame and into the overnight. The radar looks much more impressive than it is. First of all, we do have some dry air uh, down at the surface. So even though it looks like it's really dumping up in some of those areas, not necessarily. They're just picking up a little bit of rainfall. And then any of that heavier rainfall off the coast is staying off the coast. Uh, but these are those little showers that as this entire system starts to sag down a little bit, uh, those showers could pop up over our region. And so that's your little chance of rain earlier in the day. Let's take a look at this forecast model where you can see that activity. Unfortunately, that heavier rain over the water, we don't like to see that. That is gradually going to come our way, but there you can see the some thunderstorm potential actually well off the coast. I don't think we're going to see that locally, but that could go down uh, to Southern California, bring them some heavier rainfall. But if you notice, uh, we're getting less chances of rainfall with the system as it is a little farther off the coast than uh, we originally anticipated. But we still have multiple chances of rain. So one of those is today, those showers. And then as we go into tomorrow and Saturday, you can see those pockets of heavier rainfall. Uh, that's the threat of hail, perhaps, which uh, would be exciting to see and also some low snow levels down to about 2,500 feet. So uh, we'll see that on our mountains as well. So we still have rain on the way the next three days. Uh, today, though, I think it's going to be a seasonal day with temperatures in the 60s. Those rain showers not expected till later in the day. And then we do have an impact night for tonight and tomorrow and into tomorrow night because of that threat for hail. Some gusty winds Friday and Saturday and then quieter for next week. Okay, we'll look for all of that. Gina, thanks.